Hi YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome back to Phasmophobia. Today we are back with another weekly challenge and this one looks very spicy. Sanity, survival. Sanity is a scarce resource with no pills or light. Be careful finding this nightmare ghost. So actually one of the few times in the weekly challenges that we're not going to have all the evidence. Usually you have all the evidence, not here because it's a nightmare ghost. We're going to be doing this on Ritual. It's going to be fun. I hope you enjoy. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. But let's not waste any more time. Well, let's hop into the game let's go all right here we are what do we got we have uh quite a lot of tier one items which is going to be good practice because i'm going to be prestiging soon we are currently one level 104 which means it's about time that we prestige we have sanity i assume we can't see it that i think that's i said that last time too i remember i think this is a really cool challenge to teach people how to manage sanity better but they completely ruined that by taking away the sanity screen so you don't know what your sanity is. Because this is one of the single most important things in staying alive in Phasmo is managing your sanity. If you can manage it properly, you will never die. Uh, we have one sanity pill, which I assume because it's one, it actually works. I don't know why just one. I guess they wanted to balance it around single player. Because if in multiplayer, I feel like, I mean, they, they would know how to figure that out, right? When you play it with just one player, the loadout is different when, than when you play with four players. I know that's not how the weekly challenge works, but I really feel like they could have easily implemented that. I mean, maybe it's a little bit more complicated. We also have a Voodoo Doll, which is a very good cursed possession for if you want to have good control of your sanity. First of all, if you want to keep your sanity uh, at a high rate, we got to turn on the brick. Oh, I forgot about that. No lights. Okay, never mind that. No lights, of course. That was part of the challenge. I forgot. Okay, so this is definitely not a great practice for how to actually preserve your sanity. Because uh, we're not going to be able to do that at all. But we're still going to use the voodoo doll. So we're at 100 right now. If I use one voodoo pin, it takes 5 sanity. Unless it's the hard pin, in which case it'll take... Oh yeah, of course. Oh my god, he's going crazy. In which case it'll take 10%. Also, this guy's not having a great time. Anyway, I'm gonna pull one pin to find the ghost. Hopefully not die. I think I heard a knock. Over here or over upstairs. Was that here? That was not here. I thought I heard a knock on the window, but I might be crazy. I think I'm gonna run upstairs real quick. I'm not seeing any shoes out of place. That's also a thing you can find the ghost with. It's just Looking at the items, if any item is moved. Was it this thing? I don't think we're in time anymore. Must thank you for the two. And um, Chosen Horse, thank you for the 18. I can pull again. We're only at 90 then. That's fine. I hear nothing. That might be basement. Because if you don't hear anything with the voodoo doll, it has to either be far away or in a, in a big room where there's not many items. Because if, the, if there's no items close to the ghost when you pull the pin of the voodoo doll, it'll just not do anything. Uh, we also have tarot cards. Wait, we also have tarot cards. Interesting. Multiple cursed possession. Oh. What? Do you not start at 100% sanity in this challenge? Otherwise, this is a demon. You start with 75? Okay. All right. I, I, need, I, I was going into this thinking that the developers wanted to teach people how to actually preserve their sanity. But it's it's more about the challenge than it is about like teaching things about the game, which is totally fine. Uh, so you start with 75. But that still means... So I went from... By pulling the pin twice, I went down to 65. Were we really long enough here to drop 50% sanity? I don't think so. Uh, That's kind of spooky. Okay, so that's... I did, where did that come from? It came from over there somewhere. It also threw that around. Uh, do we have smudge sticks? Another really important item when you have low sanity. I'm guessing this is just not the way I, en <laughs> I envisioned it would be. Yeah, we also don't have smudge stick. Okay, so this is probably... This is the, the idiot's challenge. If you're a dumbass, you get into this situation. So make sure that you don't do like me in this challenge and you don't get into this situation. What do you need when low sanity? Always hold a smudge stick. That's very important. Always have uh, crucifixes. We only have one stinky ass crucifix, so that's not really going to help. Always have sanity pills. We don't have any freaking sanity pills. So yeah, this is... Uh, that's some normal spikes. This, you don't want to be... Don't, don't be like Henry, right? <laughs> don't be like me. We're gonna grab some evidence items and hopefully find where the ghost is to begin with. Um, I've made so many videos, but the thing is, 
I kind of don't do it that well anymore because I love when shit goes bad because it's way more exciting that way. So I haven't really shown properly how to uh, preserve your sanity in a while, which I mean, sanity preservation is not that challenging. You just make sure you stand in the light, especially with the current sanity system. Just stand in the light and you'll never lose sanity on small maps. At least it's incredibly strong. Wherever you come... It's in the garage. Okay, this is definitely an early hunting goat. Didn't I just take the sanity pill or am I insane? Am I gonna die in here? <laughs> oh, the pill seal for zero? What the fuck is this insane challenge, bro? <laughs> Why would they put one if they were gonna be bait anyway? <laughs> I mean, they must heal for something, right? <laughs> It doesn't make any fucking sense. Okay. I, I, they should have called this fuck you sanity challenge instead of sanity survival. Because sanity survival primes my ba brain to be like, okay, we're going to have to play very clever with the tools that we have. No, just you don't have sanity. Eat shit, bitch. <laughs> That's the challenge. No sanity, eat shit, idiot. Okay, I get it now. At least we figured it out. <laughs> Stop. So it's in here. We also only have two evidence. It's definitely not fast. Uh, oh, you stinky ass. Stinky butt. Did you know uh, that in 10, this is the most insane tangent of all time. In 1066, you, there's a, like a little island off to the side of, of Sweden called Gotland, I think. At least it's called like that in the in Crusader Kings 3, which is the game that I have this from. Um, and the, the person, the leader of that island in 1066, what was called Buttstain. <laughs> and no one's talking about it. It's the funniest name I've ever heard. Mayor Buttstain <laughs> in 1066. It's so good. He must have been bullied like hell. <laughs> All right, so this is bad, very bad. Uh, his name was B O T S T A I N. Buttstain. <laughs> Buttstain. <laughs> like, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> Feels bad, man. Oh my god, is this a. This has to be a demon, bro. This is insane. I can't do shit, man. Every time I walk into the house, I get haunted immediately. Don't kill me. He loves me, dude. Cards for sanity. Oh, God. I'm gonna click demon in case I die, because it's definitely a demon. This guy is really mad. This is a very... I, I don't think there's another version of this challenge, but... I mean, I guess that's just normal way of playing, right? Then it's not really a challenge. A challenge um, but actually I think not having the sanity screen here is a little silly because that means that you can't really preserve your sanity because you have no information about it uh, anyway do we have fingies we don't have fingies which is part of demons evidence where are you where are you are you here are you close are you friendly okay we have that which is also for demon uh, so then the other- wait, no, it's not for demon! Wait, what? That used to be for demon, not anymore. I mean, it's been like that for over two years, but it'll just never leave my brain. That demon is spirit box writing and freezing. <laughs> it's just stuck like that. Wait, wasn't it spirit box writing and freezing before? I swear that's how, it, like, at least it- my brain thinks it was. Is it a mimic, maybe? The fuck's going on here? This shit makes no sense. Um... Unless we start with lower sanity than I thought. Well, it's not this guy. It's not this guy. Um, that's for sure. Could be on Rio early hunt. Moroi curse just now. I don't think the more the more would have been faster before. Uh, I think on Rio is most likely right now. It's just very angry. We need to. Oh God. There's like no good looping spot if you don't have a smudge stick on this map, which is a little unfortunate because I would love to loop the ghost and figure out if it's uh, a phantom. That's gonna be a little tricky. I think we grab salt here. Salt is gonna be important. Yeah, the 75% starting sanity is is very rude. 
Yokai? No, no, no. I mean, maybe. Uh, we don't really know anything. Okay, so we have no orbs, right? I mean, we, that doesn't really matter because it's Nightmare. Uh, so, salt for Wraith. That's easy. Then we can look at the ghost. Hmm. I don't think that... We should just throw the... The thermo in there. I'm gonna grab a crucifix, but it's a level one crucifix, so it's not really gonna help in a room this big. The basement and this room are terrible for crucifixes, especially if you only have tier one. Okay. Oh my fucking god, bro. Holy shit. Okay, it's not. It's not a uh, phantom. Actually, what the hell am I supposed to do? <laughs> this ghost is so mad. Okay, so no wraith. I think it's solid step and salt. No phantom. Uh, so we're, do we have we have candles, right? I think I saw a candle, so that's actually gonna help. It's a mare's dream, maybe, because it's all dark and there's nothing. We can't test for spirit. That's kind of annoying, because we don't have um, uh, we don't have smudge sticks. <clears throat> I'm going to. Get out of here. I could use tarot cards maybe to get sanity. That'd be kind of insane tech. Uh, I want to just throw uh, the thermo is in here, right? Yeah, definitely stepped in the salt. Place this. Okay, is it cold here? It is not freezing. Okay, check. Uh, sorry, I can't turn that off. I don't know if we have dots. Do we have writing? Don't have writing. All right, get the hell out of here. I should grab the car key because that shit is annoying. Um. Can't really test. It touched the uh, touched the the locker. That's huge. Oh jeez. Okay. No fingies. No freezing. Crucifix. Bye bye. Uh, we could check for. Oh no, because EMF is not really gonna show. Because we have um. We just got a ghost event. Okay. So what do we know? We know it's not freezing, and we know it's not UV for sure. So it's definitely not a mimic. We know it's not. I, th I think I didn't see ghost orbs. Did I place it with a tripod? I probably didn't. Uh, yeah, that's a big spike right there from the ghost event. Uh, I don't think I placed it with a tripod. Let's throw down a tripod there. And also take... I don't think this looks like EMF. Uh, I'm really thinking... Potential just ghost orbs that I'm missing and then it's an Unreal or a Mare. I think that's the most likely scenario here. I know we have candles. No Mare. Did I miss something? Did it, did it, oh my god, the tiniest screen of all time. Can't wait to prestige again and have only this. <laughs> what the hell? Oh man, okay, take this. That's so great, I love it. Tiniest screen of all time just dropped. Shut up. I could easily die if the ghost hunts from an unfortunate angle. Alrighty, sir. I'm not seeing orbs, though, so I guess no orbs. Interesting. I really don't see orbs unless they're hidden inside a car, which means that on Rio is off the table as well, which means this is just normal. What the fuck? Okay, so that would mean no freezing, no orbs, which is no on Rio. Uh, that would mean none of this, which we don't know anyway. So I'm assuming it's going to be dots here. That seems most likely. And then it would be a yokai, but we really cannot test for yokai um, because we would die. We could test for yokai and die. <laughs> that is an option, although maybe not the cleanest option. I don't think it's a poltergeist because we would have seen way more chaos and way more throws happening here, which there's barely anything that happened. Um... Can I even run away in time? I don't know if I can. I mean, they are pretty far away. I'm setting up for Poltergeist right now. I really would like to get another... This is a really bad ghost room. Like, an insanely bad ghost room. Alright, let me quickly test for Poltergeist. Okay, it's not a Poltergeist. I'm gonna run. Okay, so no Pulti. We can't test for spirit at all. If this is a spirit, was that a... No, it can't be Hantu. That was my freezing breath, right? Because there's no Hantu option. Um, good spirit box. So, no poltergeist. Check. Uh, twins would have been easy, so that's definitely not it. Whether EMF is possible, 
Uh, ghost orbs is not really possible. So then it will be ghost riding for spirit or mare. I could see that. Yeah, it could be mare. Maybe we can flick some light switches and get lucky. Um, I hear riding, I think. Oh my god, I'm dead. Holy fucking shit, bro. This is actually one of the most aggressive ghosts I've ever seen in my life. This is insane. <laughs> it's insane. So it's a spirit or a mare? What do I do with the- What am I supposed to do then? I get- Because I don't have lights. <laughs> I don't have smudge sticks. <laughs> I can't do anything with this information. I guess I could pull tarot cards. And pray that I get a, like, sun card, but then what do we even do with that? And then we just die? I'm, I'm gonna leave that there for a second and, ch and confirm that there's writing. Because if it's not writing, then we don't have any info. Okay, it's definitely writing. Nice. So we have writing. Um, what you can do is a little cheesy here. And do prevent the death card, because I really don't want a death card. Okay, we get some sanity. Okay, and we're back to nothing. Okay, yeah, that doesn't really do much. Okay, that doesn't do anything. Um, okay, there we go. We get sanity. Let's go. <laughs> that actually worked out. All right, so now we have to flick light switches. That's a ghost event. Unlucky. Um... Is this close enough? I don't know if this- I think it's just a spirit. <laughs> so, uh, you basically- for mares, every light switch can be flicked every 10 seconds by every individual player. Um, to test for the mare ability. It, you can't just spam the same light switch over and over again, you have to swap between them. So that's why I'm doing this. And if you're with a team, everyone can do this individually, so you can test way more than with just one player. Uh, but I'm not getting any... Um, it's a ghost event, right? Yeah, okay. I'm not getting any interactions from this, but I also feel like if we were 75% sanity, there's almost no way this is not a mare um, because of the... Very likely early hunt. I know the breaker's off, but this still works. Even if the breaker's off. Uh, as far as I know. I mean, there's really nothing else we can... We can test here. Because we... This is such a bad room for mare testing, man. Because it's got to be so far away that there's no way it'll be close to the... To the light switch. Which is a problem. I'm just waiting for when it hunts. We've gotten one ghost event. Can you give us a sign, please? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? If you stuff, thank you for the 10 gift subs. Thank you. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you behind. That's literally me. No wonder it's such a piece of shit. Um, help me. Why don't you help me? Yeah, I don't know what to really do with this. We know the two evidence. Uh, it's either mare or spirit. Mare, if we think it was an early hunt. Spirit, if we think that the light switched to... Ah, there we go. <laughs> See, it works with the breaker off. <laughs> nice. Okay. See, you just gotta be persistent and you'll figure it out eventually. <laughs> so that's the mare ability right there. You saw how... Unless it did a ghost event at that exact time, in which case we would, we would probably see a big spike here, which we don't. So I'm gonna go with that. Holy shit, what an insane ghost. <laughs> Crazy, but I think that was that was a pretty good deduction right there. That's a that's a good ghost hunt. What a, what can I say? That was just a solid one. We survived. That was a very long hunt because it was very tough. Now, can we figure out so we did have no 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 no. Wait. I can't really figure out based on this how much sanity we have, but people said 75. Uh, I didn't pick up the bone on the toilet that people kept talking about. I'm sorry. All right. Anyway, we're going back. Let's hope that this is a little less annoying because <laughs> that last ghost 
made us run for our money, man. All right. So we know it's probably 75% sanity. Uh, we could use... Tarot cards don't help you find the ghost room because the tower card is still bugged. I really hope they're going to fix it. At least they seem to understand now that it's broken. Um, so yeah, tarot cards and voodoo door force. That's very interesting. If we start right away with this, we know we're at 70. That's okay. Ah, fuck. Well, we're at 65. What are the chances, dude? <laughs> with a one in 10% chance. Let's go. <laughs> fuck you. Normal speed. Yeah, it sounds kind of normal. What an insane troll game. Normal speed. I don't know if it sounds necessarily more quiet. This is really annoying because now the hunts are all going to be way longer than they're supposed to be because of the cursed hunts adding 20 seconds to each hunt timer. Uh, so that's a bit unfortunate. He's not going to come all the way out here. I could do a test. I don't think it's a miling. That sounded really clear from very far. I, I think it came from upstairs, so let's run upstairs. We should still be at 65% sanity right now if 70 sanity is accurate. 75% sanity is the starting point. Um, <clears throat> I think that came from here, maybe. I thought I heard a knock. Last time I thought I did too, and then it was wrong. Hmm. Ghosty bit. Is that me? Wait, what the fuck? Why the fuck did they make the closing sound? Okay, I'm seeing nothing. It did come from upstairs, or it came from the basement, I guess. There's no way they would give me the two worst rooms in the entire map in a row, right? There's no way they'll go from having the garage to having basement. Those two are, like, by far the worst possible rooms in this map. Are you fucking joking? Oh, I love it here. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Nice. Yep. Alrighty. Uh, that's that's okay. I'm not mad. Uh, we can maybe even... We can take a sanity pill if it even works at all. I think I'm not gonna take the sanity pill just to get some more information. Because the sanity pill might not work and then it's gonna be confusing. Okay, there's quite a bit of activity happening. Let's try and get the, like, this these two evidences right away. And we'll place a writing book because we know that's gonna take a while. Because <clears throat> if we... We can only look for orbs for, like, the next three minutes max and then it's gonna be hunting time oh come on <laughs> dude is that another early hunting ghost am i just getting fucked here or is are you starting at 50 percent sanity there's no way because i pulled one pin which was 10 if we start at 75 I pulled one pin, which is minus 10 because it was hard pin, which means it was 65. And then I got hunted within like two minutes again. Which means that it has to be like Mare, on Rio, uh, Raichu, which it, I don't know if it's a Raichu, it doesn't sound like it. This is very stupid. Wait, I mean, I guess during the hunt, my sanity also goes down because the hunts are really long. But we didn't get any ghost events or anything. I mean, 15%, dropping 15% sanity is quite, quite a lot. All right, let's see if we can quickly check for some stuff here. I don't, I dropped one item on the floor. I just want to see if there's Orbeez. Uh, Orbeez! Okay, Orbeez, nice. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Are you French? Are you pizza? Where are you? Can't really test for that very well. Yeah, we got level one items too. Very nice. Let me try to put this down here without dying. Take that. All right, run away from here. Um, but we have an evidence, which is nice. We got ghost troops. So let's see. Early hunting. It's definitely not a Thay. Definitely not a Revenant. I don't think it's a Hantu. Although, what the hell? Holler at your girl. Thank you for the five gift subs. Um, could be on Rio. Could be Mare again. <laughs> Two times in a row. <laughs> um, 
Okay, then. We have a camera, but I don't think I placed it down there. So, Godzilla, thank you for the gifts up. Can be a mimic? Yeah, can be a mimic as well. All right, let's grab the one crucifix. Like, this is so rude. If they gave me one tier three, that would, would be good. But this is just stinky. It's, I don't think that's even worth... Um, yeah, this doesn't really help much. We can just... I mean, we can pray for another sun card with the tarot cards, but... Not writing yet. Nothing. Why are you not hunting right now? Are you freezing, maybe? No. Devious, thank you for the gift sub. Or uh, the $5 donation. Uh, the weekly is Sanity Survival. It's a bit of a misleading title because you're not really trying to like it's not really about the preservation of your sanity it's more just we have made sure that there's no way to keep your sanity high and get fucked and they gave you 75 percent sanity starting all right uh, we're gonna grab some salt i don't know it's weird now because now it's suddenly not hunting which makes me think it was some kind of ability which makes me think it might be a yokai because why is it not hunting now then i didn't do anything i didn't change anything um, I'll grab this as well. <clears throat> Can't be demon with the ghost orb. If we saw ghost orb. I'm gonna place this here. So that if it walks out, we'll, we'll find it. No writing yet. Hmm. We had this here, so it definitely can't be a Raichu. Because then we would have heard it be fast. Is it freezing now? It's stuck at that. Why are you not hunting? Mimi? Is it even here? Oh, oh yeah, there's orbs. It's still here. Very surprising. Oh, fuck. Okay. It's gonna walk through the salt there. Hopefully not kill my ass. It's also a tiny ghost model, which is very annoying. I didn't see Hantu breath, but um, I could. I don't think this is Hantu. Hey, Devious, thank you again for the donation. There, yeah, there will probably be ghost gambling as well today. You guys love your ghost gambling. You guys got a problem. Um, we could test for Obake, but the, uh, Obake, we could just check for fingerprints. I think this actually might be another mirror on Rio. Or Yokai, but testing for Yokai is literally just dying. Because all the only way we can test for Yokai here really I, I really need to figure out better ways to test for Yokai's without smudge sticks. Because that's I mean you never really have to do that because you just have smudge sticks, right? But for the weekly, sometimes you have to. Which means uh yeah, my plan doesn't work. Because a lot of my plans involve smudge sticks, because it's by far the easiest way. But let's um we grab this and check for fingies. That could give us a hint for Obake. Writing book is in there. Dots we can't really see. Um, we could also just grab this so we know that on top of us. Did I grab a UV? I did grab a UV. That like on top of us it can't hunt, but only once, so that doesn't matter. We could test for... We could... Let's test for on Rio. I'm taking this now. I know I don't have a lighter. Um... On Rio with the with the crucifix maybe because that's really the only way we're gonna know for sure that it's not an on Rio if it uses the crucifix. That's not a wraith, but we already knew that probably. Okay, so place that there. Throw this down. Just run. I'm gonna need the lighter and the crucifix. Don't hunt. Thank you. <clears throat> we don't get all three evidence. This is a really difficult challenge. Like this is gonna. Especially in groups where your sanity, I mean sanity, there might as well not be sanity. It's just, can you figure out a nightmare ghost with being, while being chain hunted? That's the, that's the challenge. Because you're going to get chain hunted on this challenge for sure. Because like, I got super unlucky there that I got the hard pin right away, which dropped me 10%. But still, starting at 675% sanity means you get hunted very fast. Oh my god, dude. I was getting three evidence while well, you either had a mimic or you were playing the weekly challenge or you're talking about the weekly challenge from last week. Um, it's touching doors a lot, so we can check for fingies there too. 
Yeah, it's very aggressive. I would love to go... I think it's all the way in the garage. I would have loved to run off into the basement, but it's kind of risky. I have the red dot reticle. Yeah, I highly recommend the dot reticle over any other one. Because only the center pixel of the screen is actually the reticle. Everything else is just, co uh, like, cosmetics. So if you make your reticle far too big, it's only extremely confusing. Because your reticle isn't actually that big. Which means you're more likely to miss picking up items. So this way you know that center pixel is the only pixel you need to care about. Um, okay, this is annoying. Obviously you can change the color or whatever you want. I'll place that there and then light. Okay, there we go. We got it. Now, definitely not freezing unless something weird's going on. We, we have thingies. Okay. So it could very much be a mimic, which would also explain the situation very well. Then it will be spirit box. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Are you French? Where are you? Are you here? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Are you French? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? That is a perfect, perfect spear box test, so it's definitely not that. Check for fingies there. Okay, it's Nobake. Look at that. No fingies on the locker after it touched. <laughs> Let's go. Right? There are fingies on the door, but no fingies on the locker. So that's Obake. So there's a 25% chance when an Obake touches. Unless it's a mimic Obake, in which case you're the smartest motherfucker to ever live. And you can have it. Because uh, then it would have also somehow not have been freezing, which it was not freezing there. Plus, So because it's not freezing and not uh, Spirit Box, I tested Spirit Box after I did a ghost event, which makes means, means you're like on top of the ghost. Uh, very likely to get a response, so I'm gonna assume it's Obake. Uh, which, once again, just mostly the annoying ghost rooms here are making this harder than it has to be. Uh, but we got it once again. Let's go. This is definitely one of those challenges. <laughs> Might not be worth it for the money, but it is definitely fun. It's a good one, man. It's a, it's a tough one. So now, please give me a normal ghost room. Not a stinky-ass ghost room that's, like, super big. Because that's extremely annoying. And let's not use the voodoo doll at all. Although, what you have to keep in mind, 5% sanity is very limited amount of sanity. And it can help you find the ghost room instantly. So you're like, well, why are you using the voodoo doll? You're going to waste sanity. Well, if I don't, don't use the voodoo doll, maybe finding the ghost room is going to take so fucking long that I'll lose more sanity in the process. So that's the thing. You're not necessarily saving any sanity if you can't find the ghost room fast. Use the tarot cards? Well, tarot cards are just a complete shit show now, especially since they're mega bugged and the tower card doesn't work at all. Um, but once they fix that, it'll be good again. Because tower cards are like, I don't know, 13% or something of all, well, maybe more even, like 20% of all the cards are tower cards. So 20% of the time when you pull a card, nothing happens, <laughs> which is very silly. I can't wait for them to fix it. And it was just like, oh yeah. Yeah, we forgot to reference this one method. Yeah, we just, it just didn't do anything. Oops, that's on us. Like I've said it so many times, there's no way it's not the easiest fix of all time. Because we've tested it time and time and time and time and time again, and it never does anything. Whereas obviously they're able to cause an interaction by force because the voodoo doll works. So it's like, <laughs> there's obviously something very easy that's wrong because make it work like the voodoo doll and it'll fix itself immediately. So I don't know why they have just been unable to fix it. I guess it's because even like working on anything not new content related is going to slow down the development. Um, but yeah, a bit of a shame for us who are playing the game all the time and not just when there's new updates. Okay, I'm getting nothing. So I've already lost more than 5% sanity. So this is a good example of uh, it not being worth it to save your sanity by not using the voodoo doll. I don't know where it could be though. Because I have walked into every room in the map. Uh, never mind. It's right here. Okay, then. Because <laughs> that's on the floor, right? Or is that from over here? That's from over here. It's in the living room. It's in the living room. Okay, then. That's good stuff. Let's throw that out here. Okay, that's actually a much better room. We can deal... That's an incredible room, actually. 
Uh, the only downside of living room is that it can roam out of it very easily, but apparently they fix a lot of those roaming behaviors when they also fix the dots um, AI. That's what CJ said, that now the, the ghosts stick way more to their ghost room. They're way better at it. So we'll see. We can even check for orbs from outside, dude. Well, not really. Oh, there is actually orbs. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> Get screwed, ghost. All right, that's actually nice. <laughs> so we have ghost orbs. Look at that. Ghost orbs. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? This is a poltergeist. Can it even be? No, it can't be. But it's some big throws you got going on, sir. Um... Right, we need to grab the dots in the red. Hi. My heart's going crazy. Okay, so we grab these. We can even grab this because it's a way smaller room where this will actually be useful. Now, I didn't get touched by that. So that doesn't have to lower my sanity. Yeah, polter check potentially. Not having lights is also annoying for looping. I think I'm gonna grab like double writing book here to make sure we're gonna get it, hopefully. Should have done spirit box there maybe. But then I walked into the ghost, which would have drained my sanity. Grab this for UV and these two. Yeah, finally uh, a decent, decent room here. Place that slightly outside. Is it here? Don't know if you're still in here. Are you still in here? I should have dropped this in here. It is going lower here. Is it still in this room? It is still orbs in that room. So that's still the ghost room. Uh, I need spear box. It's in this mess. There we go. Where are you? Are you here? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you French? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Okay, I don't know. It's not really... Oh, I placed both books in... Wait, what? No, it threw the book! So it's not writing them, but that doesn't really tell us much. Um, Alright, can you step in that? That'd be incredible. Can it be a Goryeo? No. I don't think it's a th they would have hunted by now. Probably. More throws. More just low EMF shenanigans. And you give us a sign. Place this here so it's more likely to work. Can it be demon? It cannot be demon, so we don't have to place it in a way where it only works for demon. I'm not seeing dots. So I threw the book from that table all the way over here. It's doing some big throws, but it's not a... Oh, hi. Fuck, I wish I had salt. I can try spear box after this. And hopefully it'll walk. Where's my spear box? There. I need to wait for it to run out, otherwise you're gonna lose sanity. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you oh. Alrighty then. Jesus. I don't know if it's fast because. It's definitely not Revenant. I uh, don't think it's Hantu. Right, you would have been fast downstairs, which it's not. I don't like a double touch, but I don't think they do it during hunts. It's a Yure. Dude, if it's a Yure, it's actually such a hard ghost. Imagine here, what you could have gotten is just three Dio's or something, like super easy. Instead, we're getting like very difficult ghosts that we actually have to pay very close attention to. Okay, there we go. It is UV. Nice. So we got ghost herbs and UV once again. Which means it could be a banshee because of the singing. Which means we would get spirit or a scream. Or it would have to be freezing, which is really... Because it's definitely not spirit box. It could be mimic, but then it would have to be freezing. Which it's going to take like a million years for us to see that. So let's just hope we get the banshee scream. That could help us. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take this just in the off chance that it actually does anything. I don't think so. This might actually kill me because the paramic is hard to... It's hard to hear when the ghost starts hunting. What we could also do... Um, 
Maybe see if the ghost roams to us with like a uh, motion sensor or something. Yeah, we only have two evidence. This is nightmare mode. I think we have motion sensors, right? Why well, that would be rude if we didn't. All right, so we'll grab motion sensors and see if there's like a consistent roaming going on here. Cause I can sit in this corner here. Oh my god. What the fuck? Why is this so fucked? What the hell is that hitbox, bro? Insane hitbox. Alright then. <laughs> Whisper. You're gonna be... Opa, okay? I could loop it, but it's so hard, though. Because it'll definitely get fast enough to kill us. Another whisper! Okay, so that's two whispers already. It is really always singing, although the hunt sound does not matter. Oh, we actually have this hiding spot. That's way better. Okay, we have the best hiding spot. Um, yeah, I'm assuming the motion sensor does work. I, would te I should test it with myself. If I tried revisiting the easiest difficulty, it would be fun to do once again, like, all the difficulties compared. I've done that in the past. Because there is, like, a world of difference between the between the difficulty levels that you don't really realize when you're just, like, always playing on Nightmare or Insanity. How much different uh, the lower levels are. But they're still, like, hard on... Was that another whisper? I think it was. I turn on the TV. Which, that doesn't do anything. Also, there's no mare option anyway, so it doesn't matter. But, but it also doesn't do anything for mare anymore. So we have three whispers. But it's always singing. But it's never roaming. This is so stupid. Could do a loop, but I'm probably gonna die. Although we can die and still figure it out, right? That's like four whispers at least, and no scream. Is it another Obake? What? <laughs> Come on. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna die here, most likely. But hopefully we'll figure out the ghost in the process. I'm not seeing any changes. Is it really a mimic? I'm not seeing any changes at all. This cannot be an Obake, right? I'm dead? Okay, I'm not dead. Um... It cannot be an Obake, there's no way, because it would have had to change at least once. So then it's either a Banshee that doesn't do any Banshee stuff, or it's just a Mimic. Can we please get the freezing? Wait, did you... How the... Where the fuck is the... Oh, there it is. But it's 10 degrees in here, bro! Did it change Ghost Room? Where the fuck are the orbs now? But, but it's still hunting from there though. What the fuck? Dude, what if this is actually... Usually when we do weekly, there's like a pretty decent chance there'll be one insane ghost in there. Sometimes you'll get two insane ghosts. Three insane ghosts in one weekly challenge. Plus the challenge actually being challenging on, on top of it. This is wild, dude. There's no... It's like 10 degrees there though, so how the fuck could it be Mimic? Like it would have to be a really slow... It clearly can't be Obake, so it's either Mimic or Banshee. Those are the only options. Um, my brother in Christ, fucking chill. I wasn't barely down the stairs and you already... Okay, there is... There's orbs here, but there's no freezing temperature. Maybe that thermo is broken. We need to grab another one. Maybe that's going on. Who knows? This is very strange. It's also the weather, probably, that doesn't make it... Uh, 
easy to get the low temperature yeah broken to thermo totally maybe they accidentally pushed the the tier one nerf too soon totally totally it's going down but it's like not even remotely close we should just use more oh my god <laughs> Where's my bear mic again? It's somewhere. Work off. It's far away in the basement. Don't come up here. Where's my bear mic? I dropped it somewhere. Oh, big throw. Okay, let's check again. It is even not even remotely close. Is it really a banshee that doesn't scream? Did I drop it on the stairs? Where did I drop the, the paramic? Thought I dropped it on the table. Yeah, let's grab another one, I guess. I'm glad we have two, because I do not remember. Yeah, it's just because we have at least four whispers so far. And we had no scream. Plus, we have the main thing. So, besides the whispers, we have never seen a roam. We've never seen a roam towards our location, right? Just on the table. Just a little sneaky. Five whispers, bro. What in the fuck? Oh my goodness. Holy shit. How could it be an Obake if we didn't see any shapeshift during a whole... We looped it from start to finish and we didn't see a single shapeshift, which means that Obake would genuinely have to be broken. Because they said that there will always be at least one shapeshift per hunt. They might have just lied. Maybe not on purpose, but I'm not sure. Let's see some fingies. Okay, there's a fingy. There were more door touches here. Were there more door touches here? I'm not seeing any. I'm seeing... Oh, there's more. Okay, yeah, I'm seeing fingies everywhere. Let's place more, I guess. There, you cannot get into this. Oh, hi. Another singing ghost event. I, thought, I said you can't get into the square without walking through it immediately teleports. Fuck you. Okay, let's see. It's like a fucking Mr. Beast video over here. Dodge the lasers, ghost. See if you can. Oh, come on. <laughs> Can't use it on a different floor, that's so annoying. Another whisper! Did you hear that? That's six fucking whispers with no scream, bro. What am I supposed to do? Is it a mimic with no freezing? Or is it a banshee with no scream? What the fuck? Or is it an obake with no shapeshift? Or is it a hantu with no freezing? That that one's impossible for sure. This is unbelievably stupid. This is insane. What am I supposed to do, dude? Okay, another just fingies everywhere situation. Spirit box, we tried so much though. Let's try again for, wait, what? Can the ghost throw the thermal or am I just crazy? I might be like dropping it in weird spots. Didn't I drop it on the fucking table? I swear I dropped it on the fucking table. Where the hell did it go? It's under the table. Oh my God, stop it. Oh. <laughs> it's inside the magazine. Okay. I mean, Obake would be absolutely baffling. Because that would mean that it didn't shapeshift at all the first hunt, which is immediate bug report. Because it should be. 
it should be transporting transforming at least once we can loop it again for a whole hunt and see you touch some doors maybe uh, another just normal fingerprints everywhere Is it stuck inside here? No, it's not. Oh, there it is! Fuck you. <laughs> knocked on the window. Wait, it knocked on the window? Don't you dare hunt before I can check this. Okay, more fingies. Like, what the fuck? And it's never stepped on this. I really... It, I feel like Mimic is still the most likely situ- <laughs> Seven? Seven screams? Before I get the scream? Holy fuck, dude. I mean, we had so many sing singing ghost events, but those are like- that's soft evidence. Holy fuck, dude. It could still be a mimic. That's the most fucked up part of it. How, why did it never come through the motion sensors to me, though? That's so strange. That is unbelievable. All right, what an absolutely wacky set of three ghosts. The trifecta of absolute bullshit. But hey, we did it. That was one of the most tough weekly challenges uh, I've ever done. Holy heckaroni. Uh, so it's gonna say like 30, yeah. 35 abilities. Nice fucking try, devs. Fix your stats. These, this is a complete bullshit. This is a complete lie. Obviously, like any person with a human brain and fucking eyeballs, functioning eyeballs, could see that this is not accurate at all. We had, we had motion sensors like next to us the whole time and they never triggered so it must not have roamed to us the whole time plus it didn't only that one scream so this is complete bullshit but anyway that was uh hella dumb i <laughs> hope you enjoyed that. that was still very fun though but those were some absolute bs ghosts let me know how it went for you did you have such a bullshit set of three ghosts as well or was it easier for you i mean if you get a thay or a revenant or a dio here it's a freebie so but that's like kind of the case with every single situation or every single challenge uh anyway hope you enjoyed if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you dislike it dislike it and if you want to join the lovely gamers here in chat you can join us over at twist.tv slash instagram or click the link in the description down below thank you so much and i'll see you in the next one bye guys have a good one bye bye